Ladies and gents, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm on my way to the gym and I'm hoping, like, I'm really praying that I can film. If the gym is full, I can't really film and take videos for you guys. But if it's empty, listen, listen, I'm gonna film the best glutes workout for you guys. I promise. Mm. Like, I'm in such a good mood. Like, I am in a good mood. Why am I in a good mood? This life's good. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, stick around and comment, like, and subscribe. Okay, let's get started. So before any workout, I always make sure that I warm up either on the treadmill or I use a skipping rope. So today I ran for five minutes on the treadmill the incline is always on one or 1 1.5 or two when i'm running on the treadmill i do not run on zero at all for any reason um guys are you seeing my legs is anyone seeing my legs thicker than a snicker quads for days hemis oh my gosh guys it took me years years to get these legs but I'm so happy about my progress, oh my gosh. Okay, okay, let me get serious. Before we get started, we're going to do some glute activation exercises with a resistant band. So I got my band from Take Lot and they come as a pack of three. I will add the link in the description box. You're going to stand feet shoulder width apart and your toes pointed outwards. Then squat down low and slow. So you're going to do about five sets of these and repeat the exercise at least for 10 to 12 reps do not lock your knees as you come up come up and pause and go down The next activation exercise is a jump squat. Try and make your feet touch each other as you're jumping up and land with feet shoulder width apart. We're going to repeat this for at least 10 to 15 reps and 5 sets. So let's get down to business. We're going to start with a RDL, Romanian deadlift. I am going to keep my resistance bands on and I'm going to use a 30 kilogram barbell. So I'm just going to stand feet shoulder width apart and watch me as I go down slowly and come up slightly faster. So when I get down low, I hold it for at least one to two seconds before I come up do not face upwards keep facing downwards you will notice that i do not come all the way up just because i want to keep my glutes and my hamstrings engaged so i repeated this exercise for three sets and i did 10 to 12 reps
Next, we do a pulsated RDL. So I just move so that you guys can get a better angle. When you go down, you do two pulses at the bottom and come straight up. One, two, up. One, two, up. I repeated this exercise three times with 10 to 12 reps in between. Notice how much I push my buns backwards. Next, we do a split stance RDL. So, all you need to do is place one leg backwards, slightly bend your knees, and just do the same thing you were doing with a normal Romanian deadlift. Keep your movement slow, and then hold when you get to the bottom for at least one to two seconds. I repeated this for five sets, and I did about 10 to 12 reps. Done with the Romanian deadlifts and now it's time to set up for sumo squats, my ultimate phase. Let me tell you guys something, right? So I hate setting up for any exercise. So this is what I do. I just drag the weight because first of all, they're heavy. I am tired. <sighs> but it is what it is. I'm still keeping the resistance band on. You can take it off if you're feeling uncomfortable or if you can't keep your form. Always make sure to go down. Hold your pulse for at least one second before you go up. Do not lock your knees when you get to the top and make sure you go as low as you can. I repeated this exercise for three sets and 10 to 12 reps. It was at this exact moment that I was contemplating my entire existence. Ciao! Then I had a quick chat with one of my good friends. I haven't seen him in a very long time. Then we moved on to our next exercise, which is a elevated dead lift. Notice how my face is looking at the floor. I do not look up for any reason and I am doing this exercise as slowly as possible. So I do not put the kettlebell on the floor. When I get down, I hold for at least one to two seconds before coming up. I repeated this exercise for three sets and I did at least 10 to 12 reps. Next, we did a elevated deadlift. So I'm just using the plate to make sure that my stance is correct and my form is on point. And I'm still looking downwards and I'm not going all the way up. 
and I'm doing the movement as slowly as possible, making sure that I hold for at least one to two seconds when I get to the bottom. I repeated this exercise three times and the reps were eight to 12. Next, we did one of my favorite, favorite, favorite exercise, the good morning. So, these are good mornings. I am still standing on the plates for elevation and to make sure that I target the right muscle. So, I don't go all the way down and I pause at the bottom and I come up slowly. This exercise is a killer. Your glutes and hammies will always, always love you for these. I love good mornings. So I did about three sets and my reps were between 8 and 12. And I took my damn time with these. Last exercise was the single legged Romanian deadlift. So, this works your core, keep your core engaged. Do not put the weight on the floor and also do not put your foot on the floor. Try and keep your balance. If you can't keep your balance, a small, small tap and then you go up again. So, this works your glutes like crazy it targets that muscle so i repeated this exercise for at least 10 reps on each side and i did four sets Then I finished off with some good old skipping rope. I skipped for about five minutes and I headed to the treadmill. So this is me post gym. I'm super tired. I'm super hungry. I'm drenched in sweat. So I'm gonna get home. And what am I gonna do? I need to take a shower quickly. Then we have low shooting in about 30 minutes. Take a shower. I'll actually eat before I take a shower. I need to eat, take a shower, and 
have so many things to do today i hope i can get them all done but yeah that that was my glute workout i hope you guys enjoyed that i am super tired and i finished off with the treadmill um you should always warm up and cool down and stretch don't forget to stretch um i just did not record myself stretching i just look awkward when i'm stretching i feel like i look very awkward but i will try next time and include that um what else am i gonna do i want to try and vlog because i want to go to the mall and buy a few things i'm gonna try and vlog if i don't vlog then I, it is what it is but if i do please watch that video and then yeah that is it for my clip workout don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, guys.